so I am not naked by the way I'm actually pumping right now I'm trying out a new vlog style I actually have to use my headphones but I have my headphones the one that comes with the iPhone um, I have my headphones on my lap so it doesn't look weird and I'm, I have it on my ears but I haven't been vlogging in a while because of a phone situation that i've been having with my phone and if you guys have are new to my vlog by the way welcome to my vlog but if you guys are new to my vlog i recently upgraded to an iphone 11 pro um back in uh, mid-march i used to have the iphone x and it was working perfectly fine until maybe the second week of april and then i don't remember if i upgraded my software or or what but towards mid April, the receiver when you call somebody and you're talking to that person, like I could, I can't barely hear them. And when I vlog and I don't use my 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 um my earphones and I just use my phone, and then I play it back on my phone or on the iMovie app when I edit, I can barely hear myself. I bear, I just really hear the static noises in the background but i can barely hear my own voice so i don't know what's going on i've sent my phone to apple to replace not replace it to repair it and like i didn't have a phone for a week and i got my phone back and then it wasn't even fixed and i i went back and forth calling at&t and apple trying to figure out if i can get a replacement device or whatnot and they had suggested that i you know turn my phone in and send it in so they can fix it but it was never fixed so I don't know what's going on I really don't want to be on speaker every time I talk call somebody or want to have to worry about carrying my earbuds every time I go out if somebody calls me you know what I mean so I think I'm gonna call up Apple today today is Saturday June not June yet May 30th um, today is Saturday May 30th and I think I'm gonna try to call Apple and see if I can get a replacement device because my phone is still under warranty because it is pretty pretty new. I think I spoke to an AT&T rep and they have told me that I can get a replacement device so we will see how that goes and hopefully the replacement device even though it's a refurbished device um, that I can the replacement device won't have uh, problems but I'm here with Landon. Hi! Hey, Bubba. And I still have to change his diaper, but I did. I was getting ready while he was drinking his bottle. He was on his pillow. William was laying on his bed with him, and Stella was waking up. So uh, I decided to have her sit with me while I got ready. I just put on this simple makeup. Um, I am planning to film a um, an Elf haul. Um, I did order some stuff online on Elf.com and cosmetics so i'm gonna haul that and i'm also gonna haul i think three or four more products that are not elf related i think i purchased that at ulta i believe i think i'm not quite oh no not ulta um colourpop no not colourpop where did i push it ulta yeah probably ulta anyway yeah that's what i'm gonna do today i'm just gonna film a little mini haul um i haven't filmed on my main channel for so long because i've just been trying to still try to get used to the whole sleeping schedule of stellas and also i had landing in my room but now he is currently in William's room and that's going to be his permanent room situation right now. So he's no longer in our room and all that, right? Let me flip you guys around. What you doing? Hi. Hi, Bubba. Good morning. Did that smile. Bless you. Hey, bless you. So anyway, I have a lot to update you guys on what's been going on because I haven't vlogged in so long due to this phone situation. Um, I just, I did vlog during William's birthday, um, his actual birthday, and I went to edit it and I was just not satisfied with how it turned out. So I never really uploaded it. So hopefully with this whole um, earphone thing, um, that it'll work, but I did uh, do the testing and it sounded fine, so we'll see how it goes, but I'm gonna have to keep my phone, my earphone somewhere where it can't be seen. But I'm gonna go ahead and finish pumping. Right now there's really no plan except to just relax, and I also do again want to film that haul. But yeah, just today is just a regular day. Um, again, I'm gonna update you guys on what's been going on. I'll also explain the room situation right here later on but I'm gonna go ahead and finish pumping because the 
sound of the pump machine probably isn't too satisfying so I will check back with you guys in just a bit. Hey guys, so we are dressed for the day. We are dressed for the day, at least Landon is. We have a little bit of a mess right here, but I wanted to take the time to show you guys the new kind of room situation. I did post a picture on the, of this on Instagram. You guys have not seen it, so it looked much neater on the Instagram post, but I'm gonna show you guys what's going on and what the room is looking like in terms of uh, Landon's side of the room. Okay, so over here, um, we bought this little uh, three-tier bookshelf in Dollar General, and it was very easy to put together, and I just basically have Landon's book on the first shelf, a William's book, and a bin full, full of knickknacks, and I usually have his lounge pillow over here along with his playmat, and this is a picture that fell, but I have to pick that up, but I had the lounge pillow on my bed because he was using that. And in this crib, we bought in Walmart. I ordered it from Walmart. This was Stella's old monitor right there. Um, Stella has a new monitor right now. But I just keep that monitor to keep an eye on Landon. But we bought this uh, crib at Walmart and it's a really, really nice gray color. It's not too dark or too light or anything like that. And in the bed, the flea blanket came with a bedding set, but the sheet that came with it is dirty. So I did change it up and I did buy it when I ordered the crib. I did purchase a an extra set of crib, uh, crib sheets, so yeah, but this is the crib and I really like the color, um, he does look, he, he loves his crib, so, and then over here we have like another bin situation, um, a box of diapers and um, one of those sterilized drawers and then there's, there's the laundry basket, I do have to fix that area over there, oh, excuse you, I do have to fix that area over there and we decided to get both the boys these bins. Um, the girls also have them because it's space friendly and it's not expensive. And some of the, more, uh, the clothes that are not in there are hanging up in their closet. This is what the room looks like right now. So it's a little messy, um, especially on William's side. But we're gonna have to clean all this up sometime this weekend. But so far, this is what the room is looking like. Oh, and I forgot to mention, we also bought this. Um, Walker, not walker, like a bouncer, walker, it's like a four in one thing, it has every little thing in here. So we bought this walker and he really loved that, he's still trying to get used to it. Um, I do have some toys and a bib on there just so I have it ready and on hand. But it's a four in one thing, it's supposed to be a walker, a bouncer, and something, and a, an actual activity center, that's what you call it, an activity center. And this activity center is from uh, Tiny Love or made by Tiny Love and we bought this and target so it's quite pricey but he really liked it anyway like i said today is saturday oh and i'm also using my selfie stick to hold the camera so it looks it has a better angle you guys hi you see yourself is that you is that you landon but i am using my selfie stick to get a better angle and hold the camera better but or the microphone also the current situation like i was saying i do have my headphones plugged in on my phone and i have the headphones on my lap so it's not in the way of the whole vlogging situation but um i did replay it on my phone and the sound quality is pretty good so um anyway i'm gonna go ahead and go outside in the dining room and see how everybody is. Let's just go outside and see what the other two kids are doing. Elizabeth is, of course, still sleeping. Um, but yeah, you wanna go outside? You wanna go outside? Yeah. All right. Oh yeah, what'd you have for breakfast? 
you have cereal for breakfast? Oh, I want a snack. You want a snack later, okay? Oh, I want a banana. You want a banana? Yeah. Okay, get your banana in a minute. Hey. What you doing? Playing with that. You finish your cereal? Yeah. Okay. Dollar, did you finish your cereal? Mm -hmm. Okay. So full of self-confidence And everything you said made a lot of sense I thought I was too cold to ever love again But every single word cut through the rain We see the distance grow So I just got done feeding the baby. He has been eating. I'm a picture. Huh? I'm a picture. Picture? Video, you mean? Say hi. Dala, look. Okay, so Landon has been eating solids for a while now. Um, I've just been feeding him baby food. No table food yet. I haven't tried uh, table food. But he's been eating right now bananas and peaches, and I've been giving him Gerber food, so I haven't really tried again baby um, table food yet. But I usually mix it with a rice cereal. Mm. So when I first started feeding him solids, I did start off with just the actual food just to see, you know, how he reacted. I'll post a video or insert a video of when he first had his first tasting but he did pretty good um i still have to buy him a high chair i'm probably gonna order that later today i did find a high chair in walmart uh, on the walmart website so i'm gonna order that today and um hopefully it'll be here within the next couple of days when i feed him i usually have him on my lap or sitting him sitting on the counter or the activity center but yeah he's been doing so good um he's been doing good so far in terms of the feeding and all of that right now he is up to eight ounces of uh, formula mixed with breast milk again i'm not nursing anymore but i am still pumping which is really good um, i'm not getting as much as i want to but it's enough because i just mixed it up anyway with formula but he is up to eight ounces i still have to call his insurance card to see why his insurance is cancelled because it hasn't been a year yet because he needs to get seen by a doctor to see how he's doing and all of that so i'm probably going to call the insurance company Monday and see what is going on because here in South Carolina or here in the U.S. insurance is supposed to last for a year after the baby's born and um, it hasn't been a year yet and they've already canceled it so I don't know what's going on but I'm gonna call up the insurance company on Monday and see what's going on with that but yeah I'm about to put him to bed and then I'm gonna go and have my first cup of coffee it's actually almost probably noon 12 o'clock 12 o'clock and I haven't yet to have coffee so I'm gonna go put in for a nap and then um, make myself a cup of coffee because I'm starving and breakfast. Also I think I don't know if I mentioned this yet in my vlog I probably haven't because I haven't vlogged in so long but I think he is teething or he, well not I think um, he is for sure teething because he's been chewing on his fingers drooling a lot and um, luckily he hasn't been fussy, so that's a good thing, but um, I think there is a tooth coming somewhere on either his bottom or his top gum. Like you can feel it when you stick your finger in there, 
and yeah, and sometimes I'll have like a like a temperature, like a fever, but not super high. And we usually see usually given Motrin or Tylenol, baby Motrin or Tylenol. Mm -hmm. But yeah, um, he's gonna be six months in a couple of days actually, June third. Yeah crazy but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and put him for a nap and then i'm gonna go and get myself some coffee and um breakfast for lunch so i will check back with you guys in just a bit i watch you as you dry do you know i'm looking can't help but smile do you know how much i love you you put my favorite song on i put my feet up and we just sing along and i can't help but feeling just loving this moment can we stay here forever i'm loving this moment can we stay here together if i could stop time don't you know that i would cause i'm just loving this moment can we stay here forever 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 i'll watch you as you sleep you don't know i'm looking with you everything's complete do you know how much i love you i put your favorite song on just to wake you up when i dance around i can't help but feeling just loving this moment can we stay here forever i'm loving this moment can we stay here together if i could stop time don't you know that i would cause i'm just loving this moment can we stay here forever 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 i'm loving this moment can we stay here She's being silly. Hi guys, so we just came back from hanging out outside. It was a really nice evening, so we decided to go outside and just hang out. We blew bubbles, or Stella blew bubbles, John was with us, and um, it was, at first it was uh, just the first three kids, and then Landon woke up, so a little bit to get him. But yeah, so we just spent a couple, or not a couple hours, maybe an hour, outside and now we're just back inside Stella just had dinner she's in a cereal kick right now so basically she'll eat anything she'll eat cereal basically all day every day don't make a mess okay mm, okay 
And yeah, I think I started the one who ate dinner um, because I just had to eat dinner because she's going to be going to bed uh, around 10 o'clock. But I wanted to come on here before I end this vlog. I'm not going to prolong it to like a two three day vlogs i just want to make it a one day vlog but i wanted to come on here to share some really good news i don't think i've ever mentioned well yeah i think i mentioned it before i i think i shared a haul for my mom not quite sure. i don't remember if i've ever posted it but my mom is actually flying via noise as like a toy my mom is actually going to be coming to the u.s finally on june 2nd so she's scheduled to fly from Manila to Seoul, so that's her uh, connecting flight is in Seoul, South Korea, and then she has a five, eight, five hour layover in Seoul, and then she boards the plane from Seoul heading to JFK in New York, and that's like a 14 hour flight. So this is her first time flying internationally, and she's super nervous. She was supposed to go with my grandparents, but um, the province that where my grandparents are, is right now, they're um, still on lockdown and they won't be they won't be out of lockdown until tomorrow and they wanted to try to fly back to Manila on June 1st but all of the flights in um, the Philippine Airlines flights are all booked because everybody's flying out trying to head back to wherever they need to head back. Now we just we're trying to change the flight from June, June 2nd to July 15th. They have to pay a fee though and I, I was going to try to change it for them. But being that the, car, the ticket was paid using my grandfather's card, he has to speak to Korean Air himself. And yeah, so we'll see how that goes. My uncle and Philippines is actually taking care of that one. And hopefully they can, they'll be able to take some, take care of some, some of that stuff. But yeah, so my mom is actually still flying to the U.S. Thank you. To the U.S. on June 2nd. And she'll be in New York by June 3rd. So I'm super excited and I won't be able to see her until maybe mid-June. She will be living with us in this complex, not in this specific apartment, but she'll be living with us in the same complex. We did apply to for a two-bedroom downstairs, so hopefully she'll get approved and all of that. And yeah, so this is going to be her first time here in the U.S., first international flight, first everything. So everybody what you doing there's nothing in there everybody's gonna try to help her out and help her adjust i'm a chef baby okay there's nothing in there mama you want the real food but yeah so i'm super excited and i can't wait to see her and we haven't seen her or i haven't seen her since june uh june 2nd i haven't seen her since 2001 so that's a very long time yep, i haven't been home to the Philippines in 2001. Anyway, I am gonna go ahead and relax. I'm not quite sure. I think I'll probably post my outro later on. But I'm gonna go ahead and relax and I start to feed William. I don't know what he's gonna eat for dinner. Not feed me. So, get your dinner. Yeah, we had actually had chicken last night from Ingles and John bought uh, already cooked chicken, mashed potatoes, potato salad, macaroni and cheese, and macaroni salad. And I had the chicken, but I had it with with rice. So I think that's what I'm gonna have for dinner again is rice and chicken with ketchup and green beans. Be careful. So I'm gonna go ahead and relax and I will check back with you guys in just your face it is written across your face if you want to talk i'm right here not gonna leave your side just feel free to open up when the moment's right across your face it is written across your face if you want to go out we can go out you can hide away just for one night but if you want to cry just let it out i'm by your side
take your pain away Cause I hate seeing tears streaming down your face I know you're strong Won't feel this way for long, no If you wanna go out, we can go out We can hide away just for one night But if you wanna cry, just let it out I'm by your side Hey guys, so it is actually two days after I last spoke in a vlog. I did vlog yesterday, yesterday was Sunday, and I did vlog but I didn't like talk or anything. So basically today is the third day of the vlog and in order to my last talking clip, I did state that I wasn't going to make this a two, three day vlog and I end up doing it anyway. Yesterday was fun, yesterday was just us going to my mother-in-law's house and we just spent some time with her, had some pasta. I should have vlogged the pasta because it was really good. But yesterday, uh, Stella was a little bit clingy. Um, she's been clingy to me lately, these past few days. I don't know what it is, but I mean, I don't mind that. She has been like just wanting for me to hold her all the time. But not when I have Landon, but when I, whenever I don't have him, she's like, she's not jealous, but she's like, she wants the same attention as I give Landon I guess which I don't mind but you know it sometimes it's a little bit crazy but it's okay but anyway today is Monday and I'm actually gonna go ahead and end this vlog right here I just wanted to come on here to film an outro for you guys like I said yesterday we went to Maria's house which is my mother-in-law's house and we just spent some time with her and all of that and then now today is Monday and I'm just gonna go ahead and relax because I have my I still have my uh, monthly visitors so um, I'm kind of feeling a little bit tired right now, so, um, both babies are napping, so I figured I'll just take this time to just relax for a little bit and work on some goals, my monthly goal for June for my college street business, and, yeah, my mom is also flying out to New York tomorrow from Manila, um, again, she has a connecting flight in Seoul, Korea, uh, Seoul, South Korea, I believe, and then has a five-hour five layover over there, and then heading back, heading to New York after that. So she'll be arriving in New York on Wednesday. So that should be exciting. I'm supposed to have a video call with them and plus my other siblings who live in the Philippines later tonight. So hopefully I'll be up by then. If not, then um, I can just call her later on. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Again, it's nice to be back to vlogging again. It's the only situation is that I have to have my earpiece on or else you guys won't be able to hear me. I haven't yet called Apple yet to get a replacement device. I'll probably try to call them tomorrow. Also, if you guys are not subscribed to my beauty channel or my main channel, um, I did just upload and publish my recent video, which is a collective haul. So if you guys want to check that out, I will have a card somewhere on the screen over here and a link to my beauty channel as well as the link to the video down in the description box so be sure you guys be sure to check it out anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog don't forget to subscribe and i will see you guys in my next vlog bye guys i wanna do it all with you by my side if you're in meet me here tonight be brave and come along i'll be your right promise we don't need no brake lights we can travel the world so just say